Five degrees right now. How hot are we going to get today? Well, I'm still keeping our high in the low to mid 90s, Dom, although I have to admit uh, this picture worries me only because the cloud cover, it's thickening up a little bit earlier compared to the last few days. Uh, so, you know, some areas, if you get the cloud cover a little bit early, you may have temperatures that uh, level off a bit and only make it to the upper 80s or around 90. Either way, it is very warm outside. We're watching showers and storms developing off to the south west of downtown Denver. Uh, that's the cloud cover I was just showing you in that city cam. Evergreen, Conifer, Marshdale, uh, down toward Buffalo Creek. If you're hearing some rumbles of thunder, maybe even getting a little bit of sprinkle activity, it's because we have some showers and thunderstorms developing. Then off to the southwest of there as you move down into Park County and into our eastern San Juan Mountains, we have one two, three little clusters of thunderstorms with quite a bit of lightning uh, starting to pop and even a little bit here outside of the Pikes Peak region and monsoon storms. We're in the monsoon season contain lots of lightning and lightning causes a lot of wildfires. We had a few start in the mountains because of lightning uh, this week. So here's your future cast three o'clock today. We do expect a pretty good coverage of showers and storms uh, and the activity over the higher elevations will slowly start to move to the east and southeast. We could see a couple of rounds of storms try to come through the Denver area may not hit everybody equally, but the cloud cover will certainly be nice. Give you a little relief from the heat by 11 o'clock tonight. Most stuff should be ending as we lose our daytime heating uh, and earlier we kind of teased you a little bit about the possibility of a few stronger uh, thunderstorms that would be mainly off to the south and east of Denver and southeastern Colorado. Large hail is a possibility from a couple of storms, meaning hail one inch or bigger in diameter. 84 at last check from our weather watcher Ron in southwest Lakewood. We are into the 90s here in southeastern Colorado, mid to upper 80s on the northeastern plains. 74. Beautiful afternoon in Breckenridge, 77 in Aspen. It's hot out west, 95 in Cortez, 90 in Grand Junction and Durango. We may see 100 today in the Grand Junction area. Still anticipating 90s here on the eastern plains of Colorado with mostly 80s in the high country. Uh, if you're above 9,000 feet, uh, we'll land somewhere in the 70s. Again, metro area upper 80s to lower 90s expected this afternoon. It'll vary a little bit based off the cloud cover, probably coolest on the south and west sides of the city. So today, uh, lower 90s with those scattered storms. A little bit warmer tomorrow. We should get into the upper 90s. You see that 100 degree temperature on Friday. And I want to kind of talk about Friday a little bit. Uh, that's the start of the Cheyenne Frontier Days. 94, sunny and hot if you plan to head up there. And then Dom, Saturday still hot, but check out Sunday and beyond. We are going to be uh, looking at temperatures. There we go, in the upper 80s to right around 90 with a chance of thunderstorm. Which sounds good, especially when you're looking at 100 degrees. Chris, it thank sure you. Does. Well, Colorado, not the only.